Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Brad, welcome back to the channel, we're back to another Yu-Gi-Oh! of Reigns video. Today we got the first spoiler cast for episode 1 of Yu-Gi-Oh! of Reigns, airing on May 10th, which is called My Name is Playmaker. So, the story takes place in Den City, which has the latest network. There, SOL technology manages the VR space Link Reigns, where people duel all day. The protagonist, Fujiki Yusaku, is a cool high school student who has excellent observation skills. To defeat the Knights of Hanoi, the plot to destroy Link Reigns, he transforms into his avatar Playmaker and tries to duel, which he is unfamiliar with. At the same time, the hacker with the same aim as Yusaku, Kusanagi Shoichi, is desperately searching for information in SOL technology about the mysterious lifeform. Meanwhile, Yusaku lays a trap on the network for the Knights of Hanoi to capture them. So, this to me is majorly contradicting, because we know from before that Yusaku has dealt with the Knights of Hanoi in his past, or specifically the Playmaker has, but here it's saying Yusaku is unfamiliar with dueling which really doesn't make much sense if you bring these two bits of information that we know and put them together. There's something we're missing here, and I think something might have happened in Yusaku's past that has affected his ability, his memory, he's unable to remember how to duel, which I think is just, that's just like some headcanon that's going on right now from reading this initial spoiler cast. Next, onto the second paragraph. A hacker with the same aim as Yusaku, Kusanagi Shoichi, is desperately searching for information about the mysterious lifeform, so again, we don't know what that mysterious lifeform is. Is it an AI, which we think it is, uh, thanks to some other information we got a few weeks ago. But it's nice to see Kusanagi Shoichi isn't an enemy. He's trying to defeat the Knights of Hanoi, maybe for his own personal reasons. Maybe he has his own agenda against them. Maybe they've, they've done something to him, or maybe he's just a nice guy. And this guy, Kusanagi Shoichi, is the guy with the dark purpley hair, which we saw in the video earlier today. Which is kind of cool, because it, it could mean these two, Yusaku and Shoichi, could end up working together at some point in this show to stop, it's like to bring them down, which I think would be a nice way to end the first arc of the show, or even to have it sort of like in the middle, or within the first 30 episodes or so, to have a duel, you know, with these two versus, you know, uh, Revolver and some other people from the Knights of Hanoi, which would be uh, quite cool to see. However, it says here that Yusaku lays a trap on the network for the Knights of Hanoi to capture them. Now, given that it's, you know, it's introduced us to, to Kusanagi Shoichi, I'm guessing that this trap is going to actually catch uh, Shoichi whilst he's, you know, trying to find out information about the mysterious life form. And this might then cause Yusaku and Shoichi to go at it and have a duel with each other, and obviously Yusaku isn't very familiar with dueling, so maybe he's going to struggle quite a bit during this initial duel, and maybe that mysterious life form or that AI that you know Yusaku apparently has if we go back to some of the other information we got a few weeks ago maybe that's going to help him out in this duel against Soichi maybe Yusaku will gain an edge towards the end of the episode because this mysterious life form transforms into one of his monsters maybe Deco Talker there is some definite similarities between these two we know this guy we know this, like, this life form is a voice so he's going to be offering Yusaku at least some aid some support but it also kind of confirms this mysterious life form has a mind of its own because it wouldn't really be talking if it didn't, it's sort of grown its own consciousness, which is quite a cool concept to think about. AI technology growing its own consciousness and building up and maybe potentially threatening the entire, not just virtual world, but the real world as well. However, one thing that was also announced with this episode was a group photo of the cast for episode 1, and that shows pretty much everyone that we saw in that initial uh, cast, photo, uh, cast information earlier today, which means we are going to be seeing, you know, Zeiss and Aoi and Go on Izuka and all these people for at least a little bit in episode 1, which is kind of cool to think we're going to be introduced right from the get-go to, you know, the main nine characters which we're going to be following and interacting with throughout this entire show in one episode, which is which is super duper awesome. But anyway, that is my thoughts on episode 1 of Yu-Gi-Oh! Reigns, the spoilers, my name is Playmaker. The title is a bit, you know, generic, it's very, <laughs> it's very anime-ish, you know, didn't really expect much else from them from this bit, but the episode plot point does sound quite interesting. You know, we're going to be having some sort of confusion between uh, Shoichi and Yusaku. Hopefully, I really hope that happens and we don't just go straight into, you know, Revolver. I hope we do get to see a duel between Yusaku and Shoichi in the first episode. It would be very, very nice to see. But that's it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all in the next one. See you then.